Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a cute, fat rabbit. Uh, it was uh, kind of requested in the comments section. I do have a rabbit on here already, but I'm going to do another one, like a different kind. And you're going to see many different versions of different animals on here. So this is for beginners, and you're going to like it. You're going to be able to do it no matter what level you're at. So grab a marker, grab a, of a pen, anything, and let's get started. Uh, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to draw the back of the head of the rabbit. Alrighty, then I'm going to draw the one ear. Then I'm going to draw the front of the face. We're, we're dealing with simple curves. So just kind of remember that very, very simple curves. All right, everything is simple, simple shapes. And I'm gonna pull another ear back here. It's mostly gonna be just repeated that shape. I'm gonna pull a line down from the top to the bottom. And then I'm gonna pull another line down right here. And that's gonna represent the inner ear. And now I'm gonna draw the body. The body's gonna be huge and fat. Um, so I'm gonna draw right here, start from the top of his neck almost. Big body there. And I'm gonna draw a curve down here, out. And then I'm gonna draw a completely flat line at the bottom. So, so far when you just sit back and look at it, it's just a, everything is simple, right? Everything is simple shapes. Don't worry about it. Don't worry if it's exact. Um, just as long as it's in the ballpark, it'll be totally fine. Uh, right now, real quick, let me pause and say that uh, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, and also like the video if you do like it up to this point. Uh, basically, when you subscribe to the channel, I'm gonna be posting three times a day, every single weekday for a good while now, and it's gonna be fun. And I, it brings a lot of energy when, uh, you know, I know people are watching. So share the, sharing the video is probably the best thing you can possibly do to the channel. So um, right now I'm going to straight line down. And I'm gonna draw a line over here to change in form. line here and so we have that and now I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw like a little hands down here so I'm gonna draw like a U shape be one of his hands and then another U shape over here so you have his other hand over there so everything is contained within this shape for the most part except for over here in the back I'm gonna draw his tail so it's just like a curve and then I'm gonna pull in right I'm gonna start also here with uh, kind of the, one of the hind legs. I'm gonna curve in here. Straight then down. Curve in here. Straight then down. Down here, down here. And I'm gonna draw just these straight lines and that's gonna make it look like the paws. And also you can draw these straight lines over here as well by splitting the front paws. Then I am going to go over here and I'm gonna draw a dot for the eye. And I'm gonna draw a straight line over here and this straight line gonna be the nose I'm gonna pull down it's just a little triangle pull a straight line downward and what you could do at the very end of it which is I'm gonna do I'm just gonna draw a little ball here like oh hello and I'm going to draw three straight lines for the whiskers on this side and then I draw three straight lines on the outside and that is it that is pretty much just like a big fat rabbit it's gonna be fun uh yeah like it's, it's fun to do this it's, it's kind of a cool fun shape as well what you could also do is what i'm about to do right now is make a thicker line around just the contour line so around the outside i'm gonna make it a little bit thicker and what that does ooh, that, that, that curves pretty hard 
You don't have to do this, by the way, but I'm gonna do it. Um, it gives it kind of like a sticker look. It makes it look almost like, you know, you, like, 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 literally like, looks like a sticker, really. I don't know how else to say it. Or like some form of graffiti. It contains some of the smaller shapes on the inside, and that can really do a lot of good for the actual design. It is really just a design element. It's there for design points. So that's what I'm gonna do here. All right, and that is it. I hope you had an amazing time. It was, uh, yeah, it, hopefully you had an amazing time. Pretty easy to do that, um, and that's pretty much it. If you have any suggestions, do me a huge favor and uh, ask me in the comment section. Otherwise, that is pretty much it. I'll see you in the next video. I'm gonna be posting a lot, so I'll see you soon. Talk to you later, guys.